In grade school, Alyssa Bustamante got good grades, was active in church, and seemed like a normal kid. By 13, she started to have problems and spent time in a psychiatric hospital. She posted on MySpace her hobbies were cutting herself and killing people. She also told friends she wondered what it would be like to kill someone. On October 21, 2009, she had her younger sister bring their neighbor, Elizabeth Olton, to the woods to play. Alyssa violently attacked the nine-year-old girl and killed her. Then she buried Olton in a shallow grave she had dug five days earlier. After her crime, she made this chilling entry in her diary. I just f killed someone. I strangled them and slit their throat and stabbed them. Now they're dead. I don't know how to feel at the moment. It was amazing. As soon as you get over the, oh my God, I can't do this feeling, it's pretty enjoyable. I'm kind of nervous and shaky though right now. Okay, I gotta go to church now. LOL. Within days, the body was found and Alyssa was arrested. She pled guilty to second degree murder and armed criminal action. For the murder, she was sentenced to life with the possibility of conditional release in 2024. For the armed criminal action charge, she was given 30 years, which will be served after the murder sentence is complete.